She first hit the stage when she was just four years old, competing in a local children's dance troupe. Well, now 12 years later, Solange Knowles, the little sister of Destiny Child, Beyonce Knowles, is stepping on center stage to live her own dream of being an entertainer. Her debut album, Solo Star, hit stores today. Solange knows. Good morning. Good morning. What explains so much talent in one family? I mean, is your mom just saying, hey, go and sing, or what's going on Actually, here? Actually, my mom was in a singing group when she was my age, and my dad has just always had records around, and it's just been growing up in a musical family. It's growing up even performing the two of you, yes. you had your own mini concerts when you were kids. How old we were you? Did. I was actually two and a half when I first started. So people didn't want to come to our house too often. <laughs> now tell me about your solo album. Actually, I bet they did. In fact, I wish there was somebody had a videotape right. because I would love to, hear, to see that videotape of the two of you. You know, w talk to us about this album. It took three months to create. You're just 16 years old. Actually, it took me two years to two create. Two years? Yes, it took me three months. I had to go back in and I did some finishing touches on it. Um, the album, it's taken so long because I wanted to make sure that it reflected me as an artist first and not just, you know, a label our mom and dad so it took me a while but I'm very excited and you really <laughs> want this album to define who you are exactly. you want it to represent who you are how would you define it using words well music basically is my life I breathe music I absolutely love it and the album basically represents all the different kind of music that I'm influenced by like the song I'll be performing has a little reggae feel to it so that's me. I and just have such a wild eclectic taste. And and Beyonce, does she um, have a part in this? In other words, did she help you out with this, cheer you along, support actually, her little sister? she gave me a lot of support, and I've learned so much growing up. But she actually wrote one of the songs on there. It was on the Scooby-Doo soundtrack, so. And, and when you hear that somebody like Randy Jackson is saying, hey, you know, I know about Solange and I know about her music, how does that make you, in other words, your, work, your name is getting out there on right. your own. Exactly. And that must feel so good because you don't want to be defined always as Beyonce's Not little sister. Exactly. Right, right, right? <laughs> exactly. So, and um, now, is, that, is it harder or is it easier to build your own dream when you're living under that I realization that you're her little sister? I think it has pros and cons. I think... I've just been so blessed because I've seen the whole journey. I've seen the whole way that the industry works, and I kind of know what I'm getting myself into. But I definitely want to establish Solange as Solange. So. Okay, well, Solange, you're establishing thank yourself. You. We're going to hear from you. You're singing the song called Feeling You. Yes, thank you. There is this guy that I'm digging What I've been looking for, don't know where to begin We've been talking, but not enough But when we do talk, the things that he says I do love When I see him and we talk There is this vibe between us, I don't want to stop So original and so deep This guy gets just like me Spend some time cause I'm feeling
Thank you. We're back in a moment. But first, this is today on NBC. You Bravo. Told me I was beautiful. What a piece of the